Hey, what's up guys, Reese here, welcome to another video, this is Iron Man Progress episode, Dead Spider Shows on the minimap, not sure, episode 159 I think, um, yeah, I just did an Araxor kill to start off the video, I'm using, it's a zero in rage, with sharp shooter aura, I still want to test this first vamp, and so far, I think vamp's better man, like, I did sharp shooter aura, it, it was a bit faster, but I mean, it wasn't my fastest time or anything, so like, I did stuff up and do some things like, for instance, I did a death swiftness, um, Shadow Channels at one point, which splashed, which could have done mad damage, but it splashed. Now, if I did, like, I don't know, a fucking Death Swiftness snapshot or Rapid Fire instead, that could have done way more damage, it, and it probably wouldn't have splashed, you know? So, um, couldn't stuff up there. Like, obviously, Sharpshooter is quicker, but it doesn't seem that much quicker that it's worth losing, uh, maybe more food. Because people say, like, the vamp only saves a little, like, heals, like, 50 or something like that, but I feel like it, it works a lot, a lot, like, better, like, I can do the whole first phase without eating once, thanks to vamp, yeah, if I do sharpshooter, just, like, because prayers heal less than 50%, they stop 50% damage, so I just have to eat, just by praying, so, you know, anyway, so let's get into Araxor, how you doing, what's the loot, 40 Hydrix bolts, mate, they're just all Alks, I think, I think that's what you guys said, well, no one answered me, I answered they were just for Alks, because, like, I'm not actually making them into, like, the bows, I don't think, I don't have a ascension crossbow, so I think at the moment for my account, they're just Alks. Hey you guys doing, welcome to the video. Two minutes, no, a minute and thirty seconds, looted one Araxor. A lot of the upcoming videos are proddy, proddy, probably just going to be Araxor, as you know, I've got, I've got the web now, so I now have to just fucking knock out a leg, which is going to take like so long, probably, so I'm going to have to like, I'm always forced to do Araxor now, because i got one piece, you can't stop, you know, you got to keep on going, it's silly. Actually, that one was a lot better, nine minutes... 35 seconds, so maybe I might, maybe, I don't know, I guess, I do low in rage anyway, so I guess it just doesn't matter which one I use, as long as I can get my 3 or 4 kills, um, or maybe I'll just do like 2, take a little break, come on, do, use the next aura, or just something like that, or either sharpshooter first, and then like, um, the healing one, vamp, a bit higher in rage, maybe something like that, I don't know, but there we go, Oh. Eight magic seeds. I thought they dropped four, or is that a double drop? I'm not sure, because that's a lot of seeds. Apparently, that's worth a mil, if that was a normal account. Fucking hell. Also, that... Not that good at the moment, but it's all... you got to put things in perspective as Iron Man. you always got to think late game. I remember I still got some wolf bones in the bank, I think, for Wolpertingers that I did. You guys, guys remember... You guys. Bloody... Bloody gays. Um, may remember it from, like, episode... Probably, like, less than ten, when I was doing Slayer um, in Canifus. And I was killing those werewolves, and I was using like an Addy 2H, and I got a um, Rune Med Helm as a drop, I was so happy, but I was collecting all the wolf bones there, I still haven't used them, but you know, that was like two years ago, and I'm collecting them for the thing, so what I'm saying is, those magic seeds will be worth something soon. <laughs> I love to ramble, boys. Jeez, guys, I'm having a rough time this morning with the Raxor, no bruise left on this one, this is at pretty much in zero and rage, I did a kill just before where I died, because I was, it was path one and three, I didn't realize it would change, so I was in three, um, and I, um... Missed like four dodges. I got the first one wrong. Then I think the second one, I I was talking to someone and I tried like I didn't realize I press didn't press enter. So I spammed the button and nothing happened. Like the arrows key because I was in the chat dialogue. And then the third one I think I just got wrong out of panic or something like that. Then I finally got through. And then when I got to the next phase, there was a it was phase one and three. So there was a bunch of spiders. And then I fucking mirror back myself and killed myself because I didn't even realize. Perfect. And then I get this one and fucking god knows what happens. But I'm out of food. <laughs> so fucking hell. Here we go. What are we going to get for it? Oh, yes! Five overload flasks. Our first time ever getting overloads. I'm so fucking happy with that. That's actually really fucking good. Yes, six doses as well. Five of them. That's fucking awesome. And ten rune plates. Dope. Off to kill some dragons. Some wonderful dragons of Gil Gilinor in a frosty dungeon thing. Multiple dragons, actually. Ones that are alive and ones that are skeletal. Sorry, I had a stroke there. I just got some daily challenges for... So, uh, not Well, not daily challenge for a frost dragon, but... Bury 10 Frost Dragon Bones or whatever, and then I've got a Skeletal Wyvern Challenge as well, so I'm just knocking those out. And by Skeletal Wyvern Challenge, I mean Super Prayer Renewals. <laughs> Frost Dragon's still a moneymaker here, also, what did I fucking get? Oh, Clue Scroll. Awesome, we can do a Clue Scroll. I remember Frost Dragon's like, obviously back in, back in the day, but even more recently, like, there's no bots here. I swear, like, even just like two years ago or something, like, even, even in AOC, they used to be full of bots, they would just be here with spears and, like, protect mage. I don't know if they had, uh... Antifires, but this is empty, so I don't know if these are not worth as much anymore. Who knows? I guess I, I can't price check them properly, can I? If I click it and bring up that, the AOE loot, 12k, okay, no, that's, seems pretty high. 
I don't know. Fuck, I wish Frost Dragons were a Slayer task. That'd be dope. Why are they not a Slayer task? Also, talking about that, I've got Celestial Dragons unlocked now. I haven't done the Slayer since we've got 99. Can't wait to get them. Yeah, if you guys didn't, like, get it once Min Minifus, once Minifus comes out, obviously a lot more fucking Slayer is going to be be done. Also, there's the challenge complete. Also, yes, I know you're going to get more XP if you put them on an Ultra and that. It's just that I'm only, it's not, I'm not, like, melting a thousand of them, you know. I'm just burying ten, and I want the XP from handing in the challenge that gives you the XP, not burying ten of them. Isn't that much? That's a Wyvern challenge complete. This is interesting, because it's one of the things I don't have is a Visage on, like, this account. Yeah, no QBD Visage, no, like, Dragon Visages. Um, yeah, I probably, when I, once I get Celestial Dragons, we'll be rolling in visages, don't worry. Or visages. Visages. I got one on an old school from Wyverns, you guys remember that video? That was fun, less than a thousand Wyverns, I got a fucking visage. Easy. Far we go, turn in, see what XP we get for these ones. Frost Dragon Bone, 17k, eh. Could have gone with more, 24k for the Herblo. And we get one qualm back, boys. Alright, now let's check this. I like this update two weeks, two days ago, so we now know that's definitely like enough time to collect it. Let's see what we got. See what we get. 2.1 mil. No, 2.2 mil. Awesome. I'm looking at these at the moment. This is what I'm most interested in. So, you know, like, yeah. Um, what is that? 32 overloads. So that's... Or 31 overloads. I don't know. Maths. So yeah, we got some, some nests for some overloads is what I'm getting out. 1.4k takes, 99 construction in the bag, 99 fire making and fletching in the bag. Ooh, 120 aventos, that's nice. Harrowlanders, 46 prayer pots, all these dwarf weeds and stuff, awesome. Then these little shitty seeds. Good stuff, I'm happy with that one. Not bad. Uh, let's see how much money we've got left in there though. Deposit another 500k. And let's go do that clue scroll, boys. Hey, your boys ready for the lootations. Here we go. Ready, die. Oh, 1.4 mil. I mean, that's because all the clue scroll items are worth like a bunch now. Bando's Mitre. Gone from bloody 20k to 1.4 mil. I'm going to have so much once I get into invention lucky components. If they're used. I know there was a big hype when it did come out. But it's like, is it actually worth making lucky stuff? Because if you guys are new to the videos, let me show you my fucking clue scroll item collection slash lucky collection right here. See, here it is. Not even my first Bando's Mitre. I wish I could price check this easier. Easier. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't even have like a thing at the moment. What do you call it? I don't even have the wealth evaluator, so I can't even... And anyway, it'd be too hard. But yeah, look, all this stuff, apparently this is all like worth a lot now, like a mill a piece or something, even like stuff like Addy Plate Legs, because they're H1. So yeah, I've got... I wonder if even these compos apparently are worth something. I'm not sure about that though. Well, let me test it. If I get this noted, bank all that, got no items on me, it should come up with a value. 8.4 mil for 12 compos. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? Let me bank all but one and see what it comes at. Because surely that's not right. 700k per compo. Well, let me just grab... As a joke, let me just grab a few things that are like, so I don't fuck up my placeholders. I'll just grab everything that's a duplicate. I want to see what I've got. Here we go. So this is just the duplicate. So this isn't even like a lot of stuff. Plus, I don't, surely the arrows aren't worth anything. They don't probably don't give the good components. And I don't think like firelighters and purple sweets do. So everything else, I just don't want to fuck up my bank. But let's have a little price check of this. 21 mil on those, on these couple little shit things. Fucking hell. That whole tab's got to be like over 100 mil then, at least. That's fucked. What the hell? Ah! <laughs> Fucking swap to a normal account now, boys! Imagine the people that are hoarding those. I know this is an Iron Man, but like, these are these went from like a K each to now fucking 800 odd K. Like, that is ridiculous. What about the U one? Is that worth a lot as well? The U702. And the... Do they give like 100% chance at it? And that's 701. Oh my god. The fuck, Jagex? How much sorry to in the body? How much is that worth? Uh, 500k. A fucking combo is worth more than a Sara body. Why? I mean, I know why, but fuck. <laughs> they probably don't sell or some shit, but that is just crazy. If I ever do, when I do unlock invention, I want to try to go for some fortunate stuff if it's worth making. Well, there we fucking go. Enough rambling, but if you're a normal account and you want to make some money, fucking probably just grinding out clue scrolls is probably fucking good money, considering like every clue is like a guaranteed reward these days or something of like an item, so you're always going to get like something. And you get combos a lot, so on a normal account, it wouldn't be bad to fucking grind out like normal clues, I don't think. <laughs> or hard clues, rather. Hey, what's up, guys? Oh, no, this is a continue on to the same video, of course. So, you guys have been yelling at me to get Prey Up. I've always wanted to get Prey Up, but I wasn't sure this was worth doing, but apparently, you know, it is. Like, I've got 19 mil. Only thing is I really use money on is construction or prayer, so I think, it's, I think that's all there is to do. 
but you want to do it on ethyl or what, what is this ethyl whatever this one is um heffin heffin i suppose um prior xp from cleansing certain stones is increased by 20 percent during this buff slash hour so we'll buy a five for now i don't know if they restock instantly um one sec it's gonna be my first time actually doing this so let's I mean, like, we've done it for daily challenges and stuff, but let's do it properly. 2.5k for the first tick, but then you just AFK and you get, like, a tick every two seconds, and then you get a big tick at, like, the end kind of thing. So this is, like, kind of AFK prayer. I'll do it until this swaps. I don't know when this started. I only just logged in. So we'll do this, see if it's any good. We've got 101k XP. I guess we'll do these five and then see what XP we're at. Um, so, yeah. I guess I'll start doing that. Like, like I said, I'm not sure, like... I've got, like I say, 19 mil or 18 mil now. I'm not, is that, like, a lot? Is that going to get me heaps of levels, or is that going to get, like, one level, you know? Like, so that's how... I don't know if it's that worth it, or I should be, like, grinding out mobs or something like that. So, we'll see. But you guys have said it a lot in the comments, so you're either fucking cunts, or this is actually good to do. Alright, so this next tick will be pretty big. I did get one tick, but I couldn't see how big it was because I wasn't paying attention. But I think it's bigger than the first one. The first one's, like, 3k when you first get on it, and then it's, like, 330 and then this one is like 10k or something really like big or maybe like 7 2.9 oh it's just 2.9k i guess you get that in between there so yeah that how much oh, if i leave if i right click there to see how much those stones cost i think it's going to like reset my thing so i don't want to see how much they cost but i can't remember already i think what they're 150k each or something like that all right there we go that is just five done very afk which is always a benefit you got to put into there cost 550k for five of them so 110k each, and I started with just over 100k, so probably like 103k to the level. I'm now at 45k. So yeah, each stone is probably about 10k XP, really, isn't it? So, is that 130 mil for 99? Is that how it works out? I don't know if it scales with level and stuff and gives you more XP and stuff like that, or what level you can start it. So that's not bad, but... I was like, mm, I'm pretty high up, but that being said, actually, I don't know, I'm, I don't need 99, do I? Let's see, set, uh, if I've done my math right, I could put, it could be like 1.3 bill, I think it's 130 mil though, um, you know, I, I'm an idiot though, let's see, set my level target to 95, let's see, 5 mil, so if, if I have done it, if it is exactly like 10k per stone kind of thing, I need what, almost 60 mil, not bad actually. Hmm, something to, to think about then? Or if I want to go just to 92 to get Soul Split and then move over to Viawatches or something like that. Well, when I get Invention Unlocked as well, it's also an option. But for now, let's do the let's do this um, when I want to fill out AFK and it's on um, half an hour or whatever this is. If I've done that right, does that sound right to you guys? Because that doesn't sound bad actually. 60 odd mil just to get to a uh, 95 and then I'll have like, everything you need in prayer. Unless there's new, the new prayers require like 99. That, oh, the next ones do, the next two, but no one does that. Shut up. I've never even seen a fucking video of Next 2. Did that flop? Was that dead content? I've n I'm not even kidding. I've not seen anyone kill Next 2. I haven't seen any videos by any YouTubers and stuff. I don't subscribe. To There's actually not a lot of RS3 YouTubers, which is funny. Because I, I make the content. <laughs> Next Angel of Death. So I don't even know what it drops. Let's see. So it does drop a weapon. Level 92. Wand. Cool. Blood Tentacle. I don't know. That is probably the pet. Don't know what these are. So yeah, that's funny. Next two, like, was that a flop? I don't even understand. I haven't heard of anything since it came out. <laughs> All right. About to get the level here. I will tell you one thing. It may seem expensive and stuff like that, but damn, is it, like, the AFK and how quick it is is fucking glorious. I'll tell you that. Like, fuck, man. That's so good. 84. I love that so much. Leech Energy Curse, baby. I want to get, like, oh. I, can I afford, like, 92 right now, I wonder? Probably not. But if I could, that'd be so good. Alright guys, so I'm done here for now. I've spent fucking like 3 or 4 mil. Um, 145k to 85. Uh, the hour did end and I accidentally like double clicked. Apparently you can do that. I walked away or something and I lost like one instantly. So that's great. But yeah, there we go. I'll try to do that every now and then when I see the hours on and I'm um, not doing something, I suppose. So yeah, cool. Well guys, we're doing something we haven't done in ages. What the fuck? Are we doing a Slayer task? I don't remember how to gear for a Slayer task, but here we are. Hope we've got everything. First time doing Slayer Task with Royal and Armadale, guys. Fucking bit of a gear upgrade since last time we've been doing Slayer. Awesome. Let's fucking rock, rock that world. It's actually, the, I think this is the task I was on when I um, finished doing Slayer, when I got 99. Because I only had 100 left. But yeah, we got to get Slayer. There's going to be a lot more Slayer coming out with um, 
Metaphos. I haven't looked a lot into Metaphos, so it's going to be a big surprise. Of course, I'm going to release some videos on it. Um, I'm not sure if they'll be in the um, progress videos, or they might be their own separate videos. We'll see. It might be just an exploring Metaphos kind of video, or it might just all be straight in the progress videos. Who knows? But yeah, I'm going to do the Slayer task for now. Hey, Serenix Gale in the chat. Awesome. In the chat, in the loot, sorry. In the old lootations there, Serenix Gale. Let me get some room to pick that, that boy up. Very happy with that one. Should we task complete here? Just pick up the rest of the loot. 306 task row, 20 points. So I haven't done Slayer in at least like a few, maybe not a few months, I don't know. Feels like it's been a while, but I don't know. Because uh, we had that break with like the quests and stuff and all that other kind of stuff. So yeah, it actually might have been something like stupid, like two months. Probably been like about two weeks. But there we go. Awesome. Um, yeah, got a little bit of Alex there. Got a Serenic Scale, got two Ferocious Rings. Overall good for fucking 100 kills. What's this guy? Is that Arams? I mean, so fucking Arams. Guthans. Guthans, interesting. Hmm. And then he's got like really, really high stats. And using Guthans. Fair enough, I suppose. On ya. Oh, prayer hour again. That It's uh 20 minutes past the hour here, so we've either got 5 minutes left. Oh, we have 35 minutes. Let's hope we've got 35 minutes. Oh, and it did end. Rip, can I sell this back or can I just chuck it? Or should I just chuck it in the bank? Can't sell it back. That's a bit fucking rude. Boys, you boys ready for the loot of the century? A leg piece onyx. Eight magic seeds. Is that back to back? Did I get that the last one? Because that, that's pretty cool. Like, yeah, no? How much XP are they like? 15 to 30? I think they're either 15 or 30k farming XP per one, so I just got a lot of farming XP really if I just got 16 of them. <laughs> Boys, you ready for the pheromone? I don't, actually, I don't want a pheromone because, I mean, instances are free as an Iron Man for a normal speed instance, which you can only set Araxel to normal speed, so it's free. But I still haven't had one, which is weird. Also, no Onyx, I want an Onyx so I can make like a Reaper necklace. So let's get two Onyxes here, please. Oh, 14 brews, fucking dope as it is, but 45 dwarf weed, 45 avento. That's a fucking good one. I'm very happy with that one. Awesome. Awesome. Well, good. Not complaining. <laughs> very nice. Thanks very much. Can I quickly try to knock out this extreme ranging potion? Oh, we got a... a pa okay. We did a Master Slayer thing that I forgot about. So we'll knock out this extreme ranging potion things, which is I think I have to go get some Grenwalls, and then... That will probably be the end of the video, because this one's pretty damn fucking long. I can go hunt some Grand Wars, or I can go over here, try to kill some mages, and probably fucking get smashed. I've got all my AoE abilities on, and the mages, like, stun you. So let's give this a fucking go like an idiot. Come on, mate. Oh, I'm already overloaded. Alright, dope. Oh, attacking them all. Not dead yet. Put freedom on just so they don't stun me. Maybe they don't stun you if you're ranging. I doubt it. But not dead just yet, so that's good. Yeah, dope. No Grand Wars spikes with the scam. Actually, I don't know what the loot is, but probably not Grand Wall Spikes. Magus. Die, mate! Yep, see ya. Where's your loots? Ah! Land to time. Get out of here, Ranger. I'm the best. Water battle stuff. Ooh, 12 Mage Logs. Come on. Yes, yeah, so we only need, like, a few spikes. I'm not expecting to actually get it here, like, straight away on video. Ooh, Mud Runes. Oh, yes! People tell me to kill these for Mud Runes. 15. That's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good, boys. Memes, love them. To be honest, range isn't a bad way to kill these. If you don't attack them, and you get them, like, if you don't attack the ranges, and you got the spawns, like, going, where it's, like, only one spawning at a time anyway, and then you're pretty much, like, killing one at a time, it's pretty fucking easy. Like, I'll kill this one, right? I did get stunned there, so it took a while, but I'll kill that one, then i move on to this one. By the time I kill this one, another one will just be spawning. So it's like you're almost just 1v1ing them anyway. So it's not too bad. Today I've made a huge mistake, like the fucking rangers dropped the Grenwalls, not the mages or something stupid. There we go, we got some Grenwalls on the floor. I don't know which one dropped them, because, you know, I'm just massacring everything. I am stunned here. Die, please. Die! Get off me, you fucking bullies. But yeah, no, that didn't take too long. Hopefully that's enough Grenwalls to make, like, three potions. I guess we'll find out in a sec. Kill this last one. I want to try to kill it without eating. Preserve the sharks, boys. No, I've aggroed another. Oh, it's a never-ending fucking death trap here. Stop. Yes! Alright. Whew. Cleared everything. I have to eat. Let's see all these loots on the floor. Feels so good. Oh, look at that. Just 73k. Potato cactus. 8 Grenwall spikes. I don't think that's enough, actually. <laughs> they use, like, 3 or 4, like, per thing. Oh, look at all this fucking food I'm wasting, boys. You triggered?
All right, that surely, hopefully, is enough. 16 Grenwells. We got. That's really good just killing them. We got 30 uh, Mudrins now, which is awesome. Like 36 Magic Logs just from that. A few Hers, Battle Staffs, Potato Cactus. Like. Fucking good supplies coming around, boys. See, that should be enough, but if we're using Vizwax to extend it, I feel like it won't be enough. So let's have a have a look. Extend that. Extreme rangings. F oh, we've got enough to make five. What a scam. What an absolute scam we've got here. How much do you need per one, then? You need five. Oh. Oh. Hey, awesome things happen, guys. I remember you guys telling me ages and ages ago when I first got Elf City and I was doing these, that to pray here to get your prayer back. And I was like, what are you talking about, boys? There's no prayer option. That's because I didn't have curses or something unlocked. And now watch. Watch me drop my prayer points, right? They're down by 40-odd points now, almost, or 30. If I just click swap prayers, it puts my... It prays. It wants me to swap my prayers, but I just cancel that, and I got full prayer points. Not sure if that's a bug or intended, but there you go. Don't need prayer pots for these anymore. Dope. I'm sure as many of you guys have probably commented and abused me by now, it is actually the Kadan Rangers that drop the fucking Gremwall spikes. The whole time, I've been misled by my memory. There was someone commenting in the last video saying like, you know, I like your videos or whatever, but holy fuck, you're dumb at the game or some shit like that. A lot of people do stuff like that. All, all entertainment at the end of the day, guys, it's not a fucking guide you're watching. If you're watching this and you think it's a fucking guide of how to level up your account, you're very misled. So this is not, this is just me fucking shit talking into a mic for like 20 minutes. And for some reason, you, some of you guys enjoy it and then some of you guys get really pissed off. One guy was like, you don't even know how to play the game. I'm like, I mean, I'm not the best at the game, but I know how to play the game. I've got a fucking maxed account and a decently high level Iron Man. Like, sure, I fucking can't solo Virago with my pants down, but <laughs> come on, mate. Don't know how to play the game. How the fuck did I get this far? <laughs> how do I open it? No one cares at all, but there you go. There's the fucking challenge completed. Alright, let's go ahead and see what zero XP we get for this. And then we will fucking... I'll leave you alone, guys. And you can go watch like someone who's fucking good at the game. But boring as shit. You're welcome. What? Cosmo's eating a fucking cardboard box. No, he's not. A 10k Slayer, 49k Herbalore. Awesome. Go watch someone three-tick woodcutting, you sluts. Love you guys. Like if you like it, subscribe and see more. The last video of our first Raxel drop did fucking amazing in the ratings, guys. I fucking, you guys are insane. It got like 142 likes as I record this thing, and like a lot of views for how long it's been up, so awesome.